Well, all right there, we are back on the mailbag. Today I have a little tip regarding your magnetic buckle, which is located on your stabilizer strap. That is this buckle right here, which quickly and easily connects just like that. I'm just gonna let you know what it's for, how it works, how not to use it, when to use it, and where to store it. Uh, and I'll also demonstrate just how easy it is to use. So I'll move that over here and uh, let's begin. The whole concept of this piece is stability. So your belt without this strap, you can imagine that you're gonna have this kind of play. So if you're, uh, maybe you're doing sports, maybe you're skiing, mountain biking, you're gonna have this kind of play with your bag. And because the X50 and X70 are deeper bags, that kind of play could be a little bit annoying and mostly that movement's just gonna burn energy. So that's why you have a stabilizer strap. So a stabilizer strap basically draws the pack closer to your back and your belt. Now there's a frame right here, so that frame basically gets pulled inward against your back and it just results in more stability, a much tighter and stabler fit, which again is just gonna save you energy in the long run. Now you don't need to use this all the time. I would suggest anything under an hour hike, you probably can get away without using it. That's gonna depend on your own personal fitness, of course. But for me personally, I'm not gonna always use this because I don't always need it, especially if I'm in and out of my bag a lot while I'm going somewhere, or if I'm just doing a 30 to an hour hike, you know, I might be shooting a bunch of stuff on the way and I might be working out of the rear panel of my bag. The actual reason we have this magnetic clip versus the opposite side, which is just a ladder lock buckle, it's because when you access your pack, you need to zip past this section and open your bag, which of course you don't need to do on the right side. So when you're not using it, this is what you can do. Simply just roll it up and tuck it in this little stash pocket right here and it's out of sight and out of mind. So I'll just give you a quick demonstration on how to use this right now. So all you need to do is just bring it in proximity of this area and the magnets will do their work. Let's just get a close up here. You see how that works? Just like that. So just bring it in proximity, just like that. And then pull forward to bring the pack tighter to your back. One little tip when you are releasing it is to draw some slack here because when you do secure it again, having that little bit of extra slack will just make it a little bit easier. And that's that. So let's put the bag down and just show you how it works in one forward motion. And that's basically it right there. So I hope that brings a little more clarity and purpose to that actual component on your Action X50 or X70 backpack. And on that note, we'll see you next time. Take care, everyone.